Hello everyone, this is Brain King, and today I have a Yu-Gi-Oh! opening for you. Today I'm opening up three of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Advent Calendar 2019. So before I get in the opening, I want to go over a few few things. Uh, please check out the video I uploaded a about a month ago that was discussion video for the downfall of Yu-Gi-Oh! In that video, I put out a strong message. And since I posted that video, I learned about some new things going on with Yu-Gi-Oh! Some of it's good, but most of it is bad. Reigns ended this past September 25th with only 120 episodes. Anime is going on an eight month hiatus, so there will be no anime except for Brain Season 2 being dubbed. And then there will be a seventh series of Yuga being aired. It's sad that the Brain's writers uh, rather just give up on Brain's and rush it and end it rather than give us a quality content anime. The ending of Brain's was rushed. The Zizens were the only reason I enjoyed watching Brain's. If it weren't for the Zizens, Brain's would have been a meh series to me. Having no Yu Gi Oh anime for eight months is a bad idea. I'm hoping for the best for the seventh series of Yu Gi Oh, but expecting the worst. I won't be surprised if by the time the seventh series comes out, they can only make some new rules that destroys all the previous summoning methods just so they can push out the new summoning method. And this is why I have no respect for Konami, the studios, and the writers. And this just proves my point that Yu Gi Oh is going down all and it's not what it once used to be. Um, also, if you're wondering where the Gold Sarcophagus tin opening is, I will not be doing it. I'm not buying the tins. And the same goes for Dual Devastator. I'm not buying it either. In my opinion, both, both those pro products are shit. And if you're wondering where the Arc 5 Manga Volume 6 opening is, I have ordered the book, but it has been delayed, so hopefully I should be getting it soon. And also, for future videos, I'll be probably doing a channel update video soon, so stay tuned for that video. But anyway, on to the calendar opening. I was looking, we're looking for this product too, um, because if we got an imp import for the Perform Pal Kariba Wants Are Missing, which is performed by Kariba Bobble. Um, I was hoping they would have imported more cards, but unfortunately this whole counter is based off of Kribo. So do I recommend this product? If you're in if you play the Kribo deck, yes I do. Or if you're looking for the new perform ball card, then yeah, I would re recommend it. Otherwise, I wouldn't recommend this at all. Yeah, because we're also still missing Ant Kribo, and that wasn't in here either. And there's still some other, you know, cards you use that we're still missing though that Kind of wish they'd stop doing the one import per set is what they seem to be doing, but it also looks like we're not getting the Star Deck 2019 either now that they're now they put an extended deco talker in the uh in the was it dual devastator. So there's another deck we're not getting, so they could so just so they can make Playmaker's uh Cyber Stack even more expensive than it already has become. But yeah, if you like Kribos, I recommend this product. If not, then, or if you're looking for the new Perform Pal monster, then yeah. Otherwise, I don't recommend it. Because these things, and if anyone wants to know the price of these things, these were $20 each, though. So, and the Perform Pal Kribo monster was online for, like, it was over $20. So actually, surprisingly, buying the product is actually cheaper than buying the card online, which is a surprise. Though I feel the card will probably end up going down in price, but I just got these calendars yesterday, and... The last I checked the prices yesterday, so it could have changed by from things change in a matter of a day. So, I think there's only other one more reprint here. Actually, yeah, I think that's the the Kribo that uh, Kribon's there when I don't have. I think I'm still missing one of those. And I'm not going to open up like this way, like, I don't know even how you open these things up either, so. I don't want to, like, mess the card up, though, so I'm just going to do it this way here. I know people probably see their way, but I've never really, I've never actually opened up calendars, even the chocolate ones that, well, chocolate them, so I never really opened one, so I don't know how to do that, so I'll just do it this way here. Cause I, I I just don't want to wreck I just don't want the cards to get ruined there, so actually, yeah so yeah Cree photons one of them, um, Kribo, you get you get all the same cards in each one though so if you're looking to build a Kribo deck yeah I'd recommend this product if not 
then I wouldn't recommend it at all. Wayne Crabill, the Alter artwork, which I don't have this one, so I guess it's nice that that's going to reprint. Um, Crebo token. And Subtil, the Philosopher's Stone. They still should, if this is based off Crebo, they still should have imported at least Ant Crebo. Link Crebo. But yeah, most of these cards are pretty easy to get. The only reason I got this was just because I wanted the Perform Pal card and apparently this was cheaper than getting the card online, so... Of course, there's still a uh, Ling Garibo, the one, the basically the dark version of this one, but that's for the At Ignisters. We don't have that one either. So Wing Creeper level nine. One for one. I, I feel like they should have taken this out and put Ant Creeper in there at least. That's like the only really not Creeper card in here. Creeborn. Rainbow Kribo. I love that one. And here's the main one I'm after. Perform Pal, Kribobble. Really good card too. Really glad you got that import there. One more Perform Pal card I was missing, but we're still missing a bunch of other ones, so hopefully we get those imported soon. Um, so I'll be probably bringing an update to my Perform Pal deck at some point now that we got a new card. Clear Kribo. Yeah, every card in here is Kribos, just except for that one for one. Detonate. Kribolt. The Flute of Summoning Kribo. Wing Kribo level 10. Which, if you're wondering which, which my favorite Kribo, my favorite one will always be Wing Kribo. Curry Bandit. That wing Kribo is just, just, just so cute. Anyway, junk Kribo. Multiply. Curry Bond. This is one I'm still missing though, so. Transcendent Wings. And Sphere Kribo. So, yeah, that's basically the whole advent calendar. And I'm going to open up these last two here on camera, even though it's the same cards pretty much every time. Like I said, there's a main card I'm after there, the Perform Ball, Curry Bobble. But yeah, it's 24 cards in total you get from these things. And these things are $20 each. They're all foil cards. I, this is the first time I've ever gotten an advent calendar product before because I didn't really know they existed to begin with. It's because I heard about there was like uh, one that was only available in Europe, I think it was. It was like a 5Ds one. And then there was like other ones they did like there was a number I think there's also like um, one for the numbers. And I didn't just hear about them until recently. And I when I when I looked at them they weren't they didn't really intrigue me very much just because um, I don't know the cards they kind of chose were just nothing appealing to me honestly maybe appealing to someone else but just it wasn't to me. And this is the first one I actually picked up because it had one of my Perform Pal imports in there so that's why I to pick this one up. Like if they actually, like if they actually put a, if they actually like twenty four imports, then yeah, this would be even better as opposed to just one import. And if they actually did like, or if they're only gonna do one import, twenty three reprints, at least do twenty three good reprints though, because that's something I could definitely recommend. Because um, all the cards in here are easy to get, and the only one that's really um, what I see getting is this one here.
there. Last of the perform pile monster. So also expect for some future videos too. Um, I'll be, because of course I still have to update Perform Palace with this, Odd Eyes Magicians and Dimension Dragons, I'll still have to update those ones. Um, like I said, I'll be opening up the, the Arc 5 manga volume six. When the seventh volume comes, the last one I'll be opening that up as well too. Um, and then there'll also be, I'll have to update my uh, Evil Hero deck and Perta Plant deck and then there'll be Marincess. So those are just some some ideas of videos to expect to see coming up there. So, yeah, you get that big, that big little pile of, hull, of foil cards there, and then main card I was after the uh, three perform pile of Kree Bobbles. But yeah, those are some uh, future videos to expect for this year, though, and uh, of course the channel update video. So, so stay all tuned for those videos. Hope you all enjoyed this the this opening video, and this is Supreme King. Sign off. Get your game on.